What's up guys? We are getting ready to throw down on some press training. As you can see, uh, Tyler found the mirror and is already getting started. I mean, really, he's a bodybuilder at heart, but uh, we're gonna train some bigger weights today. Get after it, you feeling good? I'm excited for today. Yeah. Get to pull out the fat bells, the big dumbbells. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be, uh, gonna be fun. We're gonna do some different stuff today. Yeah. Um, hopefully throw around some good weights, so uh, let's get started. Go. Huh. Come on! <laughs> Attack this! Yup, yup, let's go! Come on! You guys are probably wondering what the heck am I actually pressing? And these are Rogue Thompson fat bells. So basically, they're think of a, a kettlebell, but the handle instead of being on top is right in the center. So you reach inside and you look there and you can see the handle. So the handle is essentially right in the middle of that fat bell. It feels very much like the weight is just uh, in your fist. So there's not the same kind of uh, feeling of a dumbbell where the, the dumbbell weights would be kind of spread out if you were to do this movement. Feels awesome and it's something I've been throwing in now for a couple weeks. These uh, double standing kind of um, clean and press uh, for lack of a better uh, description. I feel like they're really carrying uh, over to a lot of my pressing movements, especially the log press. So it's just something that I'm doing for accessory work. And these uh, these fat bells, the set that I have now uh, starts, uh, the lighter ones over here are the 80s. So that's the smallest pair of 80s. And then they kind of go up um, 88s, 97s, 106s, jump all the way to 124s. And then uh, the big boys over there, are the uh, the 150s. So um, I've never got up to those yet. Again, I've only been doing this a couple weeks um, and I've done the 124. So we might have to try to pull those 150s out today and see if I can get a few reps uh, with those. But uh, great accessory movement. You know, people, I think, look at this if you've never seen it before and you're like, well, why don't you just use the awesome dumbbells you already have? Well, because this is a different movement, it's a different challenge, and it's a, uh, a great training modality uh, for me to use, and it's a new challenge for me. So uh, anyway, we're gonna keep working, but uh, wanted to explain that because I knew there'd be some questions. Attack, come on. Bang, bang, up, bang. Good job, bang. that's it, come on, come on. Bang. Good, up, bang. that's it, good. Bang. Left, let's go. Work. Finish. Good. One more inside. Let's go. Drive it up. Yes. Good. Come on, come on, come on. Last one. Yes. Finish that. Good job. All right, all right. I see it. Come on. Yes. There you go, baby. Let's move. Get it back. Come on. Come on. Up. Oh, nice. Move. Oh. Breathe, babe. Last one. Nice. Oh. Pick it up, make it easy. Let's go. Points to that, or you just, I mean, you look good doing the thing. Yeah. I mean, I was I was convinced I was going up. There was a lot of confidence when I went up to my shoulder, and then, yeah. and then I, I saw the back. confidence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What well, happened after that? Quickly went out the window. <laughs> <laughs> let's get it, let's get Come on! Come on! Here we go! Yeah!
training session here and I gotta say so far so good uh, I, the fat belts are new to me but I've never uh, done the 150s uh, so that was that was definitely a uh, an eye-opener but I'm really happy to get it done and then moving into the incline uh, dumbbell I've been playing with the uh, the 180s and the 190s um, haven't broke out the 200 yet so today was the day for those and uh, especially after doing those the 150 fat bells. I feel like doing the 200s on the incline uh, for five there was uh, was definitely a good step in the right direction. Definitely, I can tell right now that things are coming together. Definitely, the strength is going up. So, uh, yeah, I'm feeling feeling great. We're gonna keep uh, keep rocking, and uh, I'm gonna have to get a uh, a new shirt on because this thing is is soaked. But uh, just in case you guys didn't hear. This shirt is now available at shawstrength.com. Really excited about this new design. So uh, um, yeah, I know Tyler will be getting one. I already bought it. Oh, you did? Yeah. Did you, did you log on during the training session? Yeah, I did. Yeah. Okay. I thought you were just in the bathroom. No. no. Oh, okay. I didn't, I didn't. Okay, well, good for you. I guess Tyler's already got one. So if you want to get yours, shawstrength.com. We're going to keep moving with the training session. Good. Nice. Get him. Good. Good. Did you put on another new shirt? I did. I feel like it looks good on me. Well, might look better on me, but you make it look alright. <laughs> Fair enough. Let's get it. Good. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Good. the training session here and I gotta say today I had a lot of fun I feel like we got a lot of really solid work done uh, a couple personal bets for me yeah. personal best for you on the fat bells Absolutely. how you feel good I feel great yeah I got a little overzealous on a couple of the movements but like you said I mean a couple PRs we change it up today a few different movements it was a yeah. good change of pace you're well just so you guys know we mentioned it a little bit in the videos but Tyler's ramping up to America's Strongest Man yeah got that coming up so He's uh, competing actually prior to me. Uh, it's about a week, week, week or so before World Strongest Man. So it's really good because both of us are building up right now to those contests. So the training is just going to keep getting more and more intense and more awesome. So uh, we're going to keep rocking it. Thank you guys for checking out the video. For now, go out and be great. We'll check you guys later. <laughs>